Philippine news today. Please subscribe and then check notification box to get all breaking news alert. Ah, the religion of peace and tolerance. Whenever Muslims move to Western nations they try to change everything about the culture to conform to Sharia law. When they're not doing that, they're tearing down Christmas trees, because, Jesus, birth of the Son of God and all that. To them, Jesus is only a prophet, to Christians, he is God's only son born of a woman. You can see in the video several Muslim men climbing a Christmas tree in a mall. They are trying to tear it apart. They don't do a very good job which leads one to believe it must be made of metal or something. Watch the video. Now, this isn't the only time Muslims have attacked Christmas. Islamists in Maryland complain that they didn't have a holiday for their holy days like Christians do, and a school board removed Yom Kippur, Easter, and Christmas from their school calendar. Via Patriot Chronicle the war on Christmas continues as Muslims in the Montgomery County School District in Maryland successfully strip the Christian holiday from the school's calendar. In addition to this measure, the schools will no longer recognize Easter or Yom Kippur to satisfy unhappy Muslim parents and students. The controversy began when the Muslim community put pressure on the school board to include the Islamic holiday Eid al-Adha on their calendar. Their claim was that Eid al-Adha was a religious holiday that was just as important as Christmas is to Christians and Yom Kippur is to Jews. Montgomery County Schools Superintendent Joshua Starr offered a compromise. Recommended that the names of every holiday be removed from the school calendar. In a 7-1 vote, Yom Kippur, Easter, and Christmas will be removed from the school's calendar and in their place, winter break and spring break. Charges of discrimination against the Montgomery County School Board from the Muslim community have made it so that no side is happy, and everybody loses. If Muslims don't like Western culture, they shouldn't leave the countries they came from. There's absolutely no reason for them to live here if they just want to turn the country into the places they left. Note, while the incident apparently took place in an Iraqi mall, it was Muslims attempting to tear down the tree. Are Muslims in Iraq different than those in America? For some reason we don't believe they are. The same thing will happen here, when they build up their numbers to the point it will become impossible to stop them, stop them, 